Section 115 with the uh, factions among House Democrats third down still seems unlikely to be voting against legislative fix push push back uh, push back with the they're probably not going to get any legislative impacts in the past couple days Dem leaders and Obama have managed to contain the rebellion they say the impacts incoherent not our evidence says that negotiations collapsed means U.S. before force intervene besides white leaked White House documents more importantly the assertion by the two ACs not an argument they say if he had solved the link uh, I'll answer that before the negotiations fail argument because both the uh, cards are that but even if they win this argument there's still backlash to the plan which trains Obama's uh, uh, capital and triggers link to fiat's least necessary means Obama changes mind in uh, uh, fiat's least necessary means it goes through uh, it goes through the courts Congress backlash that emboldens hawks that's our argument politics is such a good to keep that ground that benefit to tons of consequence the only way to access current events education outweighs their fiat arguments which wasn't developed means you don't vote on that negotiation will happen regardless of the future outcome of future talk sanctions that will crush the talks prefer our arguments gives the child cop to give the talks a chance this is unprecedented reach out by the Iranian administration that has been supported the uh, Ayatollah that gives credibility Iran's sincerity uh, it's a question of the U.S. rest process plan only the plan risk undercutting the process Geneva 2 is set for the upcoming week all signs point to a positive outcome the uh, half evidence talks about how talks broke down in Geneva 1, but not 2. We're reading predictive evidence. All countries are on board. The deal light is likely scooted on 1115. The United States getting closer to deal with Ron's proposed deal would be complete during the next round. To talk to the team. We're going to work next week for each. And agreement's quite possible. Blue Canada still issued to negotiate. P5 plus 1 is complete. Told the unified and current issues pros the deal further. Sanctions now put the good faith on Ron's P5 plus 1 partners. The idea additional sanctions undermine the uh, international partners made the issue serious about diplomacy. There's no need for new sanctions. And they say France, but that was the reason Geneva 1 broke down. They're now on board. Clapper in 1113. Uh, administration says 11 cusp historic breakthrough. Obama cares. We just level negotiations talk about down France, South Church, London, still significant partners from the U.S., Britain, China, France, Germany, Russia, 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 Hey, I have a question. Yeah. Uh, under the Obama Net fight tab, uh, which of these cards did you read? Uh, all of them. Okay. And which ones are under the uniqueness? All of them. Create this Brown and Ramsey. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Chiefs losing it. Oh, we're not even playing yet, so we're we're definitely crushing. I imagine we'll probably go down like 14-0 pretty like in the first half. Our offense is like pretty bad. And I don't know. I don't really follow pro football. Yeah. I just feel like trolling people in red today. Well, I, I totally think you should. I appreciate that. I love trolling people. So. I think half of D3 has just been blowing up my news feed. I know, right? Louie was literally like going to people's Facebook walls just to talk shit to them. Yeah. <laughs> He'd be like, oh, good dinner. And he'd be like, oh, yeah, good luck tomorrow. Go <laughs> Chiefs. <laughs> They probably could. Yeah, shoot in favor of the Chiefs to get yeah. the Chiefs to get the I've really never talked this much shit when we've been such an underdog. It's like, I'm going out on a pretty big win right now. The undefeated underdog. Yeah. That's a good position to be in, I guess. How many points are is Denver favored at? Um, on Tuesday, it was eight and a half was the line still. It opened at like six and got up to eight and a half. I don't know what it was when it closed. Who's the best player take out Peyton first couple of plays? It might happen. 
I mean, they're definitely going to go, go after him. Why is that third string kicker playing defense <laughs> all of a sudden? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Down goes Peyton Manning. <laughs> Yeah, but this is also week 11, bro. <laughs> yeah, Louis was telling me I should put in a defense this week. Because <laughs> you had it yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, there it is. Launch fantasy cast. Oh, well, of course, I have to watch it. Doesn't resolve anything. Uh, doesn't resolve anything. Our, 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 our,
better. Uh, for a starting point, please, uh, positive Spanish prefer a sign out to 190 proves that no one gets on board unless you have a specific policy. All of the reasons why military will let the control on the case better reason why it is better to advocate for the political solution as opposed to and ask for that they don't leave sequencing or their, or their privacy to because we are a step in the right direction. There's also no trade off if it's not a place or a hospital to get to. It creates a better ethic, even if the impacts are uh, not, uh, even if the impacts are not the best, but still create a coherent ethic for debate. You should evaluate the role of the policy simulation. The twin role is not competitive because you, 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 you can be a policy analyst and evaluate the most ethical uh, form of policy. The one who takes a stance to be legal ones are necessary because there are, are some threats, however, those threats are not. Uh, I said by the way, see, we try to avoid it, but the worst one, the common policy being uh, in default to Utah, the work can be that's in nice and little custody quality, the limits of the idea with the policy may be just find a different way to Utah, and policy not supposed to be for what you have more right than the other, not supposed to be contrary to the body of the fundamental rights of people to the perspective between the wisdom of the member of the Union of Parliament, which is the way any other day. You not have an alternative framework, is not what you, uh, just because there is some form of epistemology is bad or corrupt by a proxy effort to kids we need. Uh, we can affect me some, we can affect me probably no things. If we are good enough knowledge to reason and endorse the affirmative, we are good uh, for a starting point for uh, a good for political process, and that's also nothing but the permutation, otherwise, they're uh, get shredded because they also get shredded, uh, otherwise, they get shredded out the alternative. Is it a bad starting point? Actually, our witnesses, Jake and Jake, said that they are not to the uh, Jake and Seppes, that the positive piece focus is not uh, productive because it doesn't allow for anything to happen. Also, the analysis of their framework arguments not sense. Uh, we we self reference, so we salt air replication, carbon nine, that's the way to be important. We have to see the both materials, the sensors, the sensors, the whole control. The new survey to our original inclusion part, and the moral inclusion rest will come first. Staff government, the fact that the choice was the first to be endorsed to this particular level, possibly the few more than the case of the people's budget for the be approved of the study, and the program is the first to reverse the part, and the first of also, the all fails along two optimistic orders to six months of null attempts to see the regular word of progression, maintain for the means to protect the progress press and the press of the existence of the opposite. You just find that they seem questionable. In the case of the non target, the more sensitive the target, not set the result. Is that pure speculation worth card? And pure speculation is the alternative. Is that political apathy makes the possible to gauge state states much better? Barn or evidence that keeps the key to effect the post solution. Great evidence to keep no that team knows it was back now. Now they can't, 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 now they
So in Court Shield, you just read the first Gilman card and then the, the delay card. Did you read those second two cards? Uh, first Gil Gilman card, and I marked the card, I think, at party two. leaders. Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah. That, and then you read, you didn't read those second, those next two, and then you read Mondak? Yeah. Cool. And then, Like you say the weirdest stuff.
politics. Okay. Pakistan advantage. Politics this time we're not going for what we can say that France will inevitably, uh, will inevitably ruin the talks there. Uh, also not an impact that is I can see one in our one in our argument now. The criticism there are a few problems with the affirmative strategy, which makes it impossible for you to vote affirmative first step. They don't have a coherent explanation of what their framework is other than policy analysis. If we went all of our framework arguments about why the type of policy analysis the affirmative produces is a bad one, those are all reasons to vote affirmative. They've conceded the argument, but they don't need an alternative of movement that their form of policy making is uniquely worse because it makes us uh, more sensitive susceptible to state-based uh, uh, state violence. Second is that there's not an explanation of what the impact turn is to the criticism. They just make uh, shallow arguments like uh, sometimes violence is necessary without uh, providing an example or a reason why that is true, which is probably a link argument to the case because it proves that their uh, gut check reaction is to say that the military is good without ever questioning the reasons why they rely on these basic types of militarism in the first place. Third is that the entire uh, the alternative solves, uh, the our framework solves the entirety of the F. Both of their advantages are just reasons why the United States should not uh, Use drones. None of all of our arguments about why uh, they merely placate uh, people who would say that the drone program is better. All uh, reasons why the affirmative would inevitably fail because it would justify the drone program in the first place. Now, the permutation of a day uh, just says that they're a step in the right direction. It's more uh, like they're a one step forward, two step back. They have not uh, answered any of the link analysis that was in the two and three, which means I should not have to spend a whole lot of time there. Versus the KD evidence, legal restrictions on the war power, on war powers authority, bro mask broader questions about whether or not wars should happen in the first place there, uh, questions of who we should target or who should make the decision, uh, uh, obscures questions of whether or not targeted killing is a uh, good thing to happen in the first place. Even if they're right that uh, the, the, the restrictions are possible, uh, they have conceded that it creates public support for the program, the, uh, the, the, the public support for the program they've conceded, the Tootsie Craftsman evidence which says that legitimizing drone strikes by saying that there are acceptable targets, that there is an acceptable way to determine who is and is not killable, only allows for targeted killing to become justified and makes it impossible for us to fight back against this. The uh, evidence says that it makes it uh, where dissenting voices will not be heard, which means that the inclusion of the plan can uh, only be a step in the wrong direction. Now, uh, all of the, this is a critique of legalism. They don't have a defense of the legal restrictions of the, uh, they don't have a defense of the legal restrictions in the one see All of the evidence that he reads in the 1ARA is new and it's not based on any new 2 NCR argument, which means he should reject it. And second, it's not specific to the F. The, 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 ironically, the critique is winning on link specificity. All of their defenses of things like legal Legalism and policy are, are good in the con, are good in the abstract, but in the specific context of restricting the war powers authority of the president, these uh, arguments just don't make any sense now. The framework debate is where they can't win because they have no defense of why uh, they have no defense of why they should be able to weigh the F. Other than that, it makes us better policymakers. That begs a question of the link argument. If we uh, win that your uh, use of uh, your use of, uh, of restrictions only uh, placates the people who would be against militias, and then it makes uh, it may, then it goes in reverse. Now uh, you can see in a few arguments the black evidence says that scholarship directly translates into our ability to be uh, effective political advocates, which means that the, uh, lang the, the language and the uh, frame that we use to shape the policy debates will inevitably be played out in the kinds of advocacies that we move forward, that we move towards going forward. They have conceded the Lawrence evidence, which says that the language of violence and the justification of violence all will play themselves out in every in, in every day. We, uh, might, we won't be all policymakers. We won't be able to have our hands on leave the power. We do become ethical decision makers who uh, make decisions about whether or not we should be violent, even if uh, militaries might be able to check things like World War II, our individual levels of violence are, are never able to solve anything. They uh, they, they also have no uh, answer to the Jenkins evidence. Which says this is a question of starting points. Our mental relationship is the only way that we're going to be able to resolve anything. If we uh, view the world as a bunch of nails, obviously we're always going to uh, act like a hammer. None of their starting point evidence answer uh, response to this now. Uh, they read a piece of Utah evidence. The Dworkin evidence uh, is a neg evidence. They've conceded the Nixon evidence, which is that structural violence is exponential, which means that uh, even if extinction happens, that would 
kill 7 billion people, but allowing the unending file that read that uh, occurs as a result of always focusing on uh, uh, an extinction impacts means uh, 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 means that like structural violence would inevitably will be inevitable. They also have no uh, uh, they have no answer to the impact framing of the 2NC, which says that extinction is impossible because there are, are an infinite number of intervening actors, but things like poverty, disease, and uh, poverty and disease are inevitable absent uh, absent reforms. They say there's no alternative. You can see that we don't need an alternative. It's a question of promoting better advocacy. If we uh, prove that the 1NC scholarship is uh, questionable, then you should vote negative. They uh, say the cr they say the crutchful evidence is about epistemology and questioning the basis of the 1NC's knowledge, not about the way that the 1NC represents things. Their Taft Kaufman evidence uh, just says that it makes policy analysis impossible. This is a good thing if we win. That the types of policy that the 1NC would recreate would be bad ones. They have no answer to the Collins and Glover evidence, which is the best piece and most specific piece of evidence around in the context of uh, the way that they represent uh, war and violence. Now uh, they may they say that they solve error replication. This is not this evidence again. It's not in the context of war uh, powers, which is either not granted anyway. Even if we debating could be able to solve things specifically, debating about uh, warism makes the things inevitable. They say that the state is good and that pacifism fails. It's not an explanation of the context of the alternative. You can see that the piece of Katie Evans from the says pacifism is able to solve against example of things like the Underground Railroad. Now the Pakistan and now the Pakistan interference. There is no time for this image. You've conceded that uh, we have been doing drugs for years, and there has not been enough opposition to be able to this happen. All of our turns on case will prove uh, reasons why they why, why the alternative be able to solve this anyway. Now the rubber stamping argument on the norms is just not a answer to the link argument. They just says that there would not be over. They would be able to overcome opposition. Our evidence says that they would just uh, well, they, they would literally check off on everything that the president wanted to do. All of the inherency arguments are uniqueness for this term because the president is pushing a relentless uh, drone policy in the status quo. There's not a reason why uh, having uh, having the courts all uh, having the courts be able to approve it means that Obama would not just submit everything that he was doing. Now their Waxman evidence just says that shifting that shifting to the DOD was able to solve domestic opposition. Our Zenko evidence says that that a nat international uh, pressure will force the U.S. to pull back in the status quo, which solves both of their advantages because they're both based on drones being bad. What's that? 415. 415. 
Gave up a field goal, whatever. 54 yarder, they got lucky. That's some crap. Is it in Denver? Is there in Denver they could kick it from like 80 yards? Arkansas the best on this question. They have not extended any of the arguments about bias or any of the index of our authors. Our Bullivan says that we have holes on the ground. Says 87% of Pakistanis hate the government. Which proves now is uniquely critical because now is the point which they're coalescing to overthrow the government because they've seen that the government is not going to do anything. They have promised in the past they will end drug check, but they have not followed through. Which proves now is uniquely critical. They can see that causes a coup that overthrows the government, draws all uh, powers like Russia, uh, Russia, uh, U.S., India, and China, which all causes nuclear war. Intervening actions don't solve this. Our pit evidence is on fire. Says intervening action and intervention in places which cause miscalculation between all those countries which cause nuclear war. Intervening actors. Cannot solve any any of these are cannot solve any of these are but also uh, can see that, that perception they can see the perception or two weeks evidence is specific to Sharif and is new from it is new from the end of October and says that Sharif and political leadership hate drug policy now will tank relation with the US media not willing to listen to us anymore and negotiation was critical to prevent Indo Pak war between them two which immediately uh, caused extinction in terms of uh, all their structural violence back in New York causes famine and mass uh, massive poverty makes all their impacts and elements even if they're winning the rule arguments if we win nuclear war currency space it means that you should have followed the firm well on this question means causes uh, strong lines on a much greater scale now with the norms Advantages. They turn make zero said the drone military will not increase drone strikes. They do the same in amount. They, they, when this is true, the only way they can win is being no solid But they can see the too easy. Vlad again says Obama uh, wants drone restriction. It's also a too easy card on politics as well. Since he wants to, he wants to, he wants restriction. Now he's willing to abide by them, which disproves any of their arguments. Disproves any of their arguments. They can see that district court judges are already trying to rule against the executive now, but they were overruled before. We saw explained in too easy crosses. They have no to about trickery. The arguments indicate it's critical. Uh, too solid doesn't cause rubber signings as well as the too easy evidence because they are extra. They are checked. They are shown from the executive. They already tried to uh, check out uh, the uh, the guideline for strict screening is object means there's no way to uh, go about it or rubber stamp it or bypass it. It's an objective guideline that all courts would have to apply, which answers all of the arguments. Don't even have evidence about strict screening. They say they've tagged it as such. We don't have any evidence about those things. The Zango evidence or as one of the arguments indicate that there are short reforms now, but those are only peaceful reforms that don't uh, resolve those things. But they uh, will placate the public and international public as well, which solves all, the, which solves all their offense. There's Zango evidence also about long term. We need to uh, do it now in order to solve our uh, cause the media war in China and media coup in Pakistan. Then, which, also, uh, which means only we resolve this, uh, which means only we resolve this, only we do it in the short term. Now, politics, they have conceded a blink to their impact framing that the 1AR explicitly made that short time frame acts uh, outweigh. You should prefer short time frame acts to be because they're much more likely to solve the 1 in, one in our analysis. Long term frame acts are uh, less likely, like they're a K impact. Their uh, impact is about overall trends. Those are less likely because you're uh, now to make predictions about those long term things. We've uh, blink turned this as Delta did in the 1AR. They don't get to make you two to it. They, they don't get to make any clarification. They have no way out of this. Now, the criticism, they have no specific. Uh, links about our mechanism. They have only have about restrictions in general, not about strict screening. This solves their impact to the war is okay because that means we would apply strict screening and apply the standards. For example, strict screening looks at where you got the information from, whether that information is biased or not, and whether who you're talking about that target is in uh, known links to terrorist organizations. And there's a ton of things like that. Those are objective guidelines and looks at those things, which is like free, which is uh, solves their militarism and impacts means we wouldn't cause bad interventions or bad militarism violence because if we attack someone that was not a threat, uh, if we attack someone that was not a threat, it means uh, it means that we would prevent that thing, we prevent that from happening. But if they were a threat, 
the top. You see an extinction descent uh, to their extinction descent. The alternative our synapse is on fire. It's a, uh, it proves that their alternative framework is functionally is functionally useless. It's like cognitive psychology. People are not willing to change. The uh, warism is already a big part of Tesco. It's proven by the military industrial complex. They're pushing it on to the public right now. It proves that people uh, will never be able to change. It also proves that no one in round of cognitive psychology proves that our brains are hardwired to uh, do what the public is doing right now, which means even if they win the role of the battle claims, they uh, cannot solve any of their impacts. Those things. Now, the framework should be about policy simulation to be to determine whether the 1AC uh, was good or bad. I don't know how you're confused on this. Policy simulation just means you should know uh, whether the outcome of the 1AC is good or bad. They have said their role to just determine what is ethical. If we determine that extinction, uh, always promising the most ethical or profit notes indicates that it's critical to decision making skills because it teaches you how to learn how to change your mental policy, not knowing how to do those things. Each control of it to the right. The crash rule evidence indicates that only at the starting point of the state allows us to change those things. It allows the right to that allows the right to take over the last few of the two AC uh, pieces of indicate that would cause extinction to cause worse uh, forms of violence. It's not a gut check or it's about how war hospitals just take over and cause uh, worse forms of violence. It dissatisfies to their framework because it means they do not start at a starting point in the state, but only at the question of ethics, which means they ignore those things, which means we also do not produce worse policy. Our framework is about the question of all the uh, framework trials should have yoga, all the making to all other debates, but still uh, produce better policy, even if they win this, uh, even if they win this round of producing. We also have a defense of our we also have a defense of our skull. So if church training is unique and critically to high level judiciary or government, so this is the best qualified seeds to actually been in this negotiation. She knows how they actually knows how they go down because he's seen what people argue is proves uh, he knows how to navigate and he knows how to navigate and this through the war hawk which means he uh, the best knows things they say framework solves the app first they do not they uh, do not immediately do the they immediately uh, they do not immediately do that they do not claim that as a counter plan if they do uh, strategy somehow for instance they fully peg you should not let them do that be the choice the two air strategy because they would get out of all of my alpha making it possible to be affirmative they should not get to uh, lead to the affirmative they have no way to spill over uh, to macro politics or actually outside this room which just proves on the other arm say we don't have our hands on learning power house in the case that we are still be able to change Change those things, uh, still be able to change those things anyway, though, by learning uh, those skills, even the framework, even if viewing yourself as handling cars so productive, it teaches you how to change your own critical to effect change in the world. We have a defense of legal small or strict screening cards in the one team, all defense of it, on the case in the winner's defense of it. We also have a three card in the question that says it's good to press uh, cycles of violence. They don't have no one's about strict screening, which is the only way uh, to resolve those things. The executive is uh, the executive is insulated from executive pressure, the uh, courts are insulated from executive pressure because they uh, he has no effect on them. They can still continue to do their jobs. Not a two AR, but uh, consistently, we've been consistently uh, extending those things, the extinction out ways because you can't come back from. It, your relation of future generation, a chance to live the fault of utilitarian and it's good takes into account uh, everyone. You said there's a use of utils and now if you have two structural violence and maximum return, which I wait uh, once late and never so uh, use of it is no less all the two AC door can we don't ignore structural violence. It was there it was no risk in the station impact. We would obviously prioritize uh, solving structural uh, violence. They have no interest to link their link their impact evidence is about macro political uh, macro violence and how that wars and does those things. They have made our, they do not spill over to those macro institutions. Their link evidence is about the individual consciousness, as are their alt evidence, which means they do not spill over to those things, they're solved their impact because it means uh, they do not do those things. Yes, even if they win these arguments, they don't need an alternative proof. Their framework is useless because if they uh, framework does not spill over to solve these things, there's no reason why you do those things. The intervening actors, I mentioned their intervening actors are another coup flow about how that would cause war. Because they're called this kind of thing. Okay. Okay. Okay.